Hello there. Welcome back to our channel. If you're passionate about protecting the digital world, you're in the right place. Today, we're diving into one of the fundamental concepts in cybersecurity, the OSI model. We'll break it down layer by layer in a way that's easy to understand. Understanding this model is crucial for anyone aiming to get into cybersecurity. OSI stands for Open Systems Interconnection, and it's a conceptual framework used to understand how different networking protocols interact with each other. It has seven distinct layers, each with its own unique function. Let's explore each one. Layer one, the physical layer. This is where it all begins, the hardware. Think cables, switches, and anything that physically connects devices. Without this layer, there'd be no signal transmission. Imagine trying to make a call with no phone. That's the network without the physical layer. Layer two, the data link layer. Here, data packets are framed and addressed. This layer ensures that data is error-free and delivered to the correct device using MAC addresses. It's like the traffic cop of the network, making sure data flows smoothly and correctly. Layer three, the network layer. This is where things get interesting. This layer determines the best physical path for data to travel. Routers operate at this layer using IP addresses to navigate the network. Think of it as the GPS for your data packets. Layer four, the transport layer. It's all about reliability and flow control. This layer ensures that data is transferred completely and correctly. Protocols like TCP and UDP operate here, making sure your data packets arrive intact, like a delivery service that checks every package before handing it over. Layer five, the session layer. This layer manages sessions between applications. It establishes, maintains, and terminates connections. Imagine you're having a conversation with a friend. This layer keeps track of who's talking and ensures the conversation stays organized. Layer six, the presentation layer. Here, data is translated into a format that the application layer can understand. It also handles encryption and decryption, ensuring data security. Think of it as the translator that makes sure everyone understands each other. Layer seven, the application layer. This is the layer closest to the user. It provides network services to applications, web browsers, email clients, and other applications operate here, allowing us to interact with the network directly. And there you have it, the OSI model layer by layer. Understanding this model is like having a map of the network world. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button to stay connected for upcoming content.